This is a training video for true wind calculations by hand. It's actually a pretty easy calculation. First thing to do on the mobile board is always draw a little triangle and label the sides so you can remember how to do the problem uh, if you ever get stuck. Hopefully you know the parts of the mobile board. Um, if you need to review the other video that we have, please do that. But always pick the right scale. We're using one to one in this case. And we're plotting our own ship's course at uh, 090 at eight knots, labeling it E to R. Off the anemometer, we read 30 degrees off the starboard bow at 12 knots. So you gotta determine the apparent wind. You can do that with a calculator, with your fingers, with your brain, depending on uh, how it is. So in this case, we're counting off 30 degrees off the starboard bow, circling 120. That's the apparent wind. That's the direction that the wind is blowing from, apparently, because you're on a moving ship. That's important. So the next thing we do is we just take uh, that apparent wind direction and plot outward from R to W. Always from R to W, that's a common mistake. And how long do we draw this? We draw it 12 knots. That was off the anemometer uh, from R to W. And we're using a one-to-one -one scale in this case. So whenever you're choosing the scales, take, an, take a look at the uh, anemometer, see what the, the wind is reading, and that'll help you determine it. So we draw out 12 knots, 12 miles in the direction of R to W. We label it W. I always like to draw an arrow to keep things straight in my mind. To let me visualize which way the wind is blowing on a compass. And then whatever's left from E to W is the true wind, always from E to W. This is the most common mistake, is getting this backwards. So from E to W is the true wind. You look at the uh, opposite side, and you label it uh, about 160 in this case, at 6.5 knots. <clears throat> a double check is that on a ship that's underway, the true wind is always aft and on the same side of the relative wind. So that's our heading, the apparent wind, and the true wind aft on the same side. And that's it. Good luck on your test.